Do you want to score high in your physics exam? Then you are in the perfect place. Because in this video today, I'm going to show you how you can be able to master your jam physics just in seven days. Because there's no much time left for you to prepare for your jam exam. And in these seven days, you can still cover up a lot. My name is Basi Ejogba. I'm a 400 level student in the University of Calabar studying medical everything science. And in my channel, I help students level up their academic game. I share food tips on this channel focusing on personal development. So if you love content like this, please don't forget to hit on the red subscribe button so that you can continue getting updates anytime I drop videos like this and so that you can help me grow. And just like I've said, if you have been reading, you have been reading your physics, reading your physics, and it seems like you are not trying to understand, you are not understanding it, and you just left with 15 days for you to write your jam exam don't worry because i'll show you how in seven days seven days of consistency you will be able to master your jam thesis firstly is that you have to focus on foundational topics one thing about physics is that you cannot just jump from the last and start reading from last or from the ending to the beginning no it doesn't work like that when it comes to physics in physics you don't start from if you don't start from the ending to the beginning like rather you start from the beginning to the ending so you must start focusing on foundational topics topics like motion there's a lot of foundational topics when it comes to physics topics like motion topics like work energy and power heat energy electric charges and the rest before you start moving on to radioactivity simple ac cycle uh, quantization wave particles paradox and the rest so when it comes to physics you have to start with the foundational concept start with the foundational topics and from there you grow when you get you get an idea about to, uh, to derive a particular formula from there you move into the next topic from there you move into the next topic and the rest so if you are actually panicking or you are afraid that oh you have not covered my physics or physics is still bulky or stuff like that please don't be afraid and start reading from the ending rather use that energy as it will and start with the foundational topics i have also dropped videos uh, a particular video on jam physics essential topics so you can check out that particular video and watch it also secondly is that you have to tackle tricky questions with diagrams and videos there are some questions that you feel are uh, very tricky for you to answer you try analyzing them and the more you try to analyze the more confused you get please at this particular time you don't have more time to waste there are a lot of videos on youtube there are a lot of videos you can find on online anywhere you can find these videos there are a lot of videos that will enable you solve those particular questions there's also chat gpt go to chat gpt put in that particular topic tell chat gpt to explain that topic step by step for you go to youtube search that particular video and you search for that particular topic and you get to see those videos coming out and you from there you will be able to learn because at this particular time you don't have much time to waste that you will not understand a particular topic and you skip it so for any topic you don't understand immediately rush down to youtube or rush down to google or chat gpt and try to see how you can be able to get that topic and if possible a video format or let uh, let the explanation be dra uh, diagrammatic because one thing is that the brain love visuals the brain love when you visualize stuff so if possible let that explanation be visual so that you'll be able to understand it quickly thought on the list is that there's no much time left for you do pass questions regularly do pass questions every day as far as you wake up and you eat food from morning i don't know when you wake up but from morning till night make sure at least you do 100 physics questions you know one thing is that jam repeats past questions jam repeats past questions but it is, it is not your duty to cram these past questions rather it is your duty to understand the technicality and to understand the why behind the question so it is important that you do past questions you do past questions in fact these few days that is left for you don't go to your test if possible focus on past questions do past questions every day every day of your life every day to you write your jam exam make sure you do your past questions i have also dropped a video on how you can be able to do to answer your past questions correctly where you take down a piece of paper and you get a particular past question you answer them down and if you are looking for a, a very comprehensive past question and answer drop it in the comment section i will share my whatsapp number with you chat me on whatsapp and i will share these past questions with you and lastly is that time mock exams and review your mistakes every day after you answer your past question your past questions can be manual it can be hard copy or whatsoever don't forget to do time mock exams 
fake a scenario where you download practice apps like the Everest 23 apps, you have my school apps and the rest. Try to uh, do a mock exam questions, physics, chemistry, biology, depending on your subject combination. Try to see how you can be able to answer questions as if you are already in the exam hall. And also, after you answer these questions, you see your failure, you see your mistakes. Don't just close it and say, okay, I am too. Try to review your mistakes, try to see where the mistakes is coming from, learn from your mistakes and you get to find out that gradually, gradually, through your consistency, you will be able to grow and you will be able to conquer your jam physics. Remove every form of fear, remove every form of panicking and remove every form of comparison. Drop it in the comment section, your dream jam score and also drop it in the comment section, which score? You want to get in your jam physics? Do you want to get 90 plus? Do you want to get 70? Do you want to get 50? Which I believe nobody wants to get from 50. Everybody wants to get 90 plus so that you'll be able to score high in your jam exam. Drop it in the comment section. And also, if you want my revised and comprehensive past question and answer, also drop it in the comment section. I will share this my WhatsApp number with you, just like I've said, and I will share the past question with you on WhatsApp. If you love this video and you wish to score high in your jump exam, don't forget to hit on the rest of that button and also share this video to your friends so that they can come here and get value. And in turn, I will feel motivated to continue dropping videos like this. Remember, scoring high in jam is all about consistency, it's all about cutting off distraction and focusing on what is really, really important. Your dream is valid, study hard, and you will conquer your jam. Detail. Until I see you in my next video, always remember that you're wonderful, always remember that you're unique, and always remember that you're a pace setter. I really love you. Thank you.